Brand 24 Complete Tutorial. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. In this video, I'm going to be talking about Brand24 and how you can use this absolutely social listening tool for yourself in the easiest way. And it's absolutely incredible, absolutely free. And the features are greatly immaculate when it comes to working with your social media. Okay, you can go ahead and analyze all your competitors. You can do campaigning, get a summary of all your uh, analytics, you know, get your ad revenues and all. And it's all accessible through this. And it's pretty incredible. So to start things off, what you're going to do is come to brand24.com. Now, you can actually use the link in the description below to sign up to Brand24 for free. Okay, it's pretty simple. So please use the link that I provided down below and uh, sign up to Brand24 for absolutely free. So once you're here, you're going to come up to the sign up page like this. Now, once you're in your sign up page, what's going to happen from here? is it's going to bring you here where it's going to ask you your email and password. So what you're going to do is just add, you know, whatever business email you have, obviously make sure that it's a proper business email that you use commonly. So, you know, you can get the general idea. So I'm just going to add it over here. Okay. And click on sign up for free. Now, once you do that, it registers to your account and uh, you know, that's pretty much about it. So it gets you straight into this place so enter keywords and key phrases enter brand competitors or hashtags to monitor so you know if you want to let's say i want to go ahead and uh, monitor nike i want to monitor adidas you know big shoe companies i want to fix in adidas then there's puma you know there's uh umbro all these great brands once you do that click on next so track only in selected language so we have all these uh, languages i'm gonna go ahead and click on english so only track the selected languages and click on create project so you add in keywords for the actual competitors you want to analyze and then add in the language you want to analyze them in. now it brings you here so it says while we gather all your mentions answer all your questions below so you know how would you like to use brand 24 so there's competitor analysis, there's brand management, market insights, media news, monitoring, and all that. So choose whatever you want. I'm going to go with the competitor analysis because that helps you analyze all the, uh, you know, insights and all the workings of your competitors. Then there's brand management. Obviously, make sure to go with that. There's market insights, okay, where you can get an uh, understanding of your target audience and gather insights into the trends. Then uh, you have social media and influencer analytics where you can optimize your social media strategy by seeing all the social media and influencers that are talking about the different brands and how you can actually uh, bring them in to talk about your brands as well. So I'm going to do that and I'm going to go ahead and click on continue. And once it does that, it brings us to the dashboard. So congratulations, you created your first project. And that is how easy and simple it is to get straight into this. So again, you can start using this right away by using the link in the description below to sign up to Brand24 for absolutely free. Okay, it's absolutely free. Go ahead and uh, check these things out for yourself. So once we're over here, what we are going to want to do is we're going to come to this section it's a pretty uh big informative dashboard so this is your main dashboard over here right because we've created our project obviously you can create more projects uh to add you can add more keywords create more projects but i'm just going to go back to the dashboard and work on the current project that we have right now so first of all here's the nike project and to go into this dashboard you're simply going to click on nike and it's going to bring you to the panel where you have uh, reached the Nike keywords. So here you can see the analytics of different things. So the blue obviously is uh, the mentions for Nike, I assume. And the green is the reach. Okay. So pretty basic, pretty considerate. And down here you can see all the keywords that you've used across different, uh, you know, websites and all. So on TikTok, you can see people have talked about Adidas. Then, you know, people are talking about Nike on Quora and there's Adidas on YouTube and a whole lot more. So it keeps going on and on. And you can actually cite the different social media platforms that are talking about the brands that you've added the keywords for. Then obviously moving on on the right hand side, you have the sources that I've been talking about them. So there's Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, videos, news, podcasts, forums, web blogs and a whole lot more. You can also see the sentiments that they get. So first of all you can see the negative sentiments. So these are all negative sentiments where they talk negatively about the brand. So, you know, you can get a whole general idea 
of how which brand works and how it works and what people talk about on all these separate brands okay and then moving on once we've talked about this is obviously your main analytical dashboard which summarizes everything so these are your mentions then you can go into the summaries tab over here okay and in the summary tab, what you can do is uh, you can get an instant access to the key metrics and focus on what matters the most. So this is basically an analytical summary of all the things that uh, you have, uh, you know, gotten an insight of for the brand. So these are all the keyword summaries that you can get for yourself. Again, pretty easy, pretty simple to get your head around all these things. And uh, they give you a pretty good general idea of how you know, your brand 24 works, how your brand 24 insinuates, what your brand 24 actually provides you. Okay. Here on the right hand side, you can see the graphs of how their mention goes, what their social media reaches, how many social media reaches have they got, how many interactions they've got, how many are positive, how many are negative. So obviously we can see that the positive to negative ratio is very good. You know, 5,000 positive reaches and around 1,500 negative reaches. So pretty good reach you can get a summary of all the analytics then you can get an analysis uh, which could be you know a bar graph analysis a chart analysis and all that again you can get all of those things in your analysis center over here where you can see all the data analysis that you basically get from summary okay so you get a bar graph a chart graph a pie graph you know whatever you want you can change the views as well then moving on you have sources okay now, sources are basically all the places and websites you get these informations from. So, you know, the mentions can be from uh, Facebook, Instagram, Quora, Twitter. So those are basically your sources. That's where you can get the source of information from. You have influencers that have been using the brands that you've used as a keyword for to keep sight on. And uh, once you get all the influencers, you get their profile name, you get their sites, their mentions, and how many shares they've gotten. So, you know, people at Worldstar have used Worldstar is basically just for shoes mainly. And that's where you get uh, all mostly the mentions for Nike, Puma and Adidas on. Then you have all these other places. Mostly it's TikTok. So you can see the most outreach you get for these things is on TikTok. So, you know, you could obviously use influencers to use TikTok for this as well. You can also see their influencer score, how well they are as an influencer. Then moving on, there's the report section. So... You can actually create reports on the data you analyze and the actual, uh, you know, working you get out of all of this. So you can analyze all of that and it gives you a email summary that you can report to yourself or to other people in your organization for Brand24. So in summary, Brand24 is your buddy that helps you analyze brands. It helps you summarize these brands and it helps you work the best when it comes to the actual you know analytics the statistics and the proper working forms of these brands okay so that's uh, pretty much the whole idea of it and that's how you're going to use this so if you enjoyed watching please do make sure to drop down a like and subscribe to the channel and please do not forget that there's a link in the description below that will help you sign up to brand 24 for absolutely free okay so yeah, that's pretty much about it. So thank you for watching this video all the way till the end and I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.